How are you grade 5 kids? We are now in week 8, lesson 3. Definition and description of a proportion. The two ratios are proportional if the product of the extremes is equal to the product of the means. Thus, proportion means the two ratios are equal. To find proportion, we can use cross-multiplication. After going through this lesson, you are expected to define and describe a proportion. Copy the picture using the grid lines as a guide. Count the squares carefully. Illustrate the figure. Let us explore and discover the answers to the given problem. Cassandra uses 3 kilos of sampalok to make 24 dozen of sampalok candy. What is the ratio of the number of sampalok candy to the number of sampalok used? The ratio of sampalok candy to sampalok is 24 to 3 or 24 is to 3. We can form another ratio from 24 to 3 by reducing this to lowest terms. 2 to 3 equals 8 to 1. How did we do this? 24 divided by 3 and 3 divided by 3 equals 8 to 1. How do we check if the second ratio is proportional to the given ratio? There are two parts in a proportion, the means and the extremes. So 24 times 1 equals 24, that is the extremes. And 3 times 8 equals 24 also, and that is the means. Learning task 1. Draw a heart if its given ratio shows proportion. And draw a star if it does not. Number 1. So let's multiply 3 times 27. 81. 9 times 9. 81. Proportion. Number 2. 7 times 3, 21, 1 times 5, 5, not proportion. Number 3, 15 times 15, 225, 5 times 5, 25, not proportion. Number 4, 8 times 1, 8, 2 times 4, 8. Proportion. Number 5, 6 times 40, 240. 20 times 12, 240. Proportion. Learning task 2. Read and analyze the problem. A bag of N and N sweets contains just yellow and orange sweets. For every two yellow sweets, there are six orange sweets. Complete the table below, then answer the questions that follow. Let's complete the table. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36. So 8, 16, 32, 40. Number 1. What is the ratio of orange to yellow sweets? 6 to 2. Or 3 is to 1. If you have 8 yellow sweets, how many orange sweets will you have? 
24. There are 32 switches in the medium-sized bag. How many yellow will there be? 8. Number 4. In the extra-large bag, there are 40 switches. How many orange will there be? 30. If you look into the sweets in a bowl and found 16 yellow sweets, how many sweets are in the bowl? 64. Learning task 3. Solve the given problems. Number 1. What number compared to 10 is the same as 25 compared to 5? So, n to 10 equals 25 to 5. n times 5, 5n. 10 times 25, 250. 250 divided by 20 divided by 5 equals 50. Number 2. Juliana saved 60 pesos in a 4 weeks. At this rate, how long will it take to generate 300 pesos? 60 to 4 equals 300 to N. So 60 times N, 60 N. 4 times 300, 1,200. 1,200 divided by 60 equals 20. Number 3. A motorist traveled 240 kilometers in 3 hours. At the same rate, how long will he take to reach 400 kilometer distance? 240 to 3 equals 400 to n. So 240 times n, 240. 3 times 400, 1,200. 1,200 divided by 240 equals 5. 